it is Friday, March 2nd, uh, the day after my 10th tax all. And today, uh, my brother Brett and I are at um, Muncie Ball Memorial Hospital getting some genetic testing done. We're here waiting for the nurse practitioner to come in and she'll go over some information about the tests and what all the tests we're getting. And then um, I will be able to get the blood work today. The reason why I'm getting it done now is I'm almost done with my chemotherapy and then we'll need to know kind of what route, which route to go. The plan right now is to do the four to six weeks of radiation because um, at this point there's no known um, genetic breast cancer background in our family at all on both sides of my families. So, but that doesn't mean that I don't have it so they have to test for it to make sure and um, so once we know that, like if I did happen to have it, the specifically the BRAC1, BRAC2, and then there's like another one. Um, uh, but as far as I understand, I'll get tested for several. I don't know how many, that's what she's gonna explain today. But if that does come back, then we'll look at surgeries. So that'll be an all different ball game. So we will come back on um, and let you know how it goes. Thanks. Bye. <laughs> Go. Okay, hi. Okay, so we've just had our um, informational meeting about genetics, and now we're in the port room, which is where they will draw um, the blood from my port right here. Thanks, Brad. Uh, and Miss Jo Allen is a nurse here. She's asked not to be featured on here, just her hands. So she will, she will be drawing uh, for my port and then we should get the results back. We'll make an appointment in about two, two and a half weeks. Um, so I'm a little nervous because a lot of people with uh, triple negative who are under 40 have a really high chance of having the BRAC1, BRAC2 mutation. So that makes me a little nervous about that. But um, either way, it's gonna be okay if I have it. Um, sorry. It's okay. <laughs> I've been a crying hot mess but um anyway either way if I have it it'll be good for for me to know um and family members as well so it'll be positive um or, or good for me to know I don't hope it's positive I hope it's negative um but it'll be good to to get this done and um to know the results so we learned a lot they're testing for like a hundred different cancers but it's only certain mutations um the, and then they'll tell you actually the percentages that you have um, of having, you know, which cancer or whatever. So um, that's it. So my port's sore. Don't hurt me and I won't scream. <laughs> <laughs> My face said. <laughs> <laughs> I knew she would. I knew she wanted to be featured. It's all right. We can get a blood return now. Here's your chart, Joellen. Thank you very much. You're welcome. We have another. Uh, yeah, thank you. Well, this is what it's a saline. Keep your head just like that. No, no, like you were before. Like Perfect. This? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, we're good. <laughs> Maybe it was the way I was turning my head. Yes. I know they messed with some things when they put the port in. They said that they had a really hard time putting my port in. Yeah. And all my muscles are on this side are messed up, so. There's our waist. This is how I've never had my blood drawn out of my port. I always get it. You haven't? Uh-uh. Oh. 
Oh. Well, because at Newcastle, they don't draw the they, Oh, that's no, right. No one's right. trained, so I actually have to make an appointment with Teresa to come at a certain time instead of going, you know what I mean? I need to pull one to draw. So. Teresa, draw, Teresa doesn't draw it out of your form? Yeah, she will. Oh, okay. That's what I mean, that she will, but um, no one else is trained to do it. So yeah. any other yeah, lab, that, I go, yeah, no lab I go to, so I have to go to the cancer center. Yeah. That's what they told me, so. Um, mm-hmm. I've actually, this is the first time, that's why I'm having him tape, because this is actually the first time I've got it uh, drawn like that before. It's so weird how this works. You want have to... I've got another saline and I have a half. Okay, thank you. Mm-hmm. So now you're, you, did you get all the blood you needed? Yes. And now you're just cleaning it. Just cleaning it out. Okay. Not too bad. This does not hurt at all. And sometimes it hurts when they s- stick the needle in, but it actually did not hurt at all. But they give you some lidocaine to put on before, and I remembered to do that. So that helps definitely. So, and Joellen's fabulous too. So, that always that always helps. Why? Well, thank you. You're fabulous too. Thank you. So this whole time, nothing really hurts. It's sometimes uncomfortable, but um, the saline is not. I'm not very good fan of that because <laughs> it makes me almost vomit because I can taste it in my mouth. But again, guys, this is not horrible. Like this is fine. Sorry, I take my. Yeah, thank you. I take my um, blood thinning medicine at night, so sometimes if I get it drawn in the afternoon, either way it'll bleed. I'm a little too my blood's a little too thin. So thank you. All right, that's it. Um, thanks, guys. Till next time.